Hey everyone. So today is a Friday. I am getting ready to go to a doctor's appointment. This is my 32 week appointment. So very routine um, appointments at this point. I'm going every two weeks and I just check my weight, check the baby, talk about stuff and then I'm out of there. So that's what we're getting ready to do now. And let's see, yeah, I also need to, I wanna stop by Target and I wanna look in Bye Bye Baby because um, Sefton has now transitioned from his um, booster seat to a backless booster. Now, the one that I got for him, which is the um, Diana's one, um, the back does come off and it's just the little booster bottom part. But he's had that for a couple years now and it's like a really light color and it is completely like stained. And usually that doesn't bother me because I like things to be lighter so that I can see the stains and wash it routinely. But I've washed this seat cover several times and the stains are like not going anywhere. So I want to find him a new booster seat. Plus, we've been buying a lot of stuff for the baby and I feel like I'm you know, I just want to buy him something um, new. So since his brother is going to have a new car seat, I figured I'd get him one, you know, a big boy booster, um, backless one. So I'm going to look in Target. I'm also going to look in Bye Bye Baby and see what I can find. I don't know what's going on with this ponytail today. That's the thing about like having layers when you cut layers in your hair, like it's hard to get like a smooth look but anyway it's hot today <clears throat> so i'm just wearing a dress per use well actually it's it's only 75 so that's not bad um maybe i'm just hot <laughs> I, I have the air on and the cellophane going at all times um pk thinks i'm completely crazy because he's like um it's freezing in here but i am comfortable so i'm like Get a blanket, put on a sweatshirt, get a jacket. I'm fine. Like, it needs to be comfortable for me because I cannot stand being hot. So, I am going to grab my bag, put on some shoes, grab my keys, and then we're going to head to my doctor's appointment and then run some other errands that I need to run today. I need to stop by my UPS box and see if there's anything there. And yeah, so it's just going to be a little spend the day with me vlog. Um, not really doing too much, but I just thought I'd bring you guys along with me. So let's go. All right, guys. So I just got everything ready here for my turkey burger got my lettuce tomato and these are the buns that i've been loving the brioche hamburger buns from whole foods as you can see that i've been on a turkey burger kick i like to add kobe jack to my burger so i'm gonna put a slice of that on top these are the turkey burgers that i have been enjoying just organic turkey burgers by Applegate Organics. So those are really good. Seth and loves these too, so it's great. This is the Chipotle aioli that I like for my sweet potato fries. I haven't tried this on a burger yet because I just like spicy brown mustard on my turkey burger. No mayo, no ketchup, just mustard. Um, but this is good for dipping your fries sweet potato fries in so that's that and here's my burger just added some pepper I just put some um, garlic powder black pepper and a little bit of pink salt on it and yeah it's gonna be so good and those are my sweet potato fries one moment all right guys turkey burger is done just having my favorite hibiscus LaCroix. It's 
sparkling water. So good. All right guys, so booster seat shopping was a fail. Bye Bye Baby did not have one backless booster. I don't know what's going on there. Uh, the one that I wanted from Target was not in stock. So I'm basically going to have to order it. So yeah, but I did just pick up a few things for the baby. Since I was in there, I was not going in there with the intent to buy anything for the baby. Um, but once I saw that they didn't have what I was looking for, I was like, well, I'm in here, might as well buy something. So um, I needed to get him some newborn long sleeve onesies. Um, I am going to be taking these with me to the hospital for his bag. Um, and so I just wanted to get some long sleeve ones. He has these in other sizes, but he did not have newborn. So yeah, I had every size except for the newborn ones. So I wanted to get a pack of these. And so I got that. I also saw this cute little pacifier clip. It's so cute. It's gray and white. Hold on, guys. Hey, Dad. All right, sorry about that, guys. That was my dad. Um, but anyway, I got this cute little pacifier clip for the baby. It's so cute. It's white and gray, and you guys can see the little marble. Let me turn this light off. It's so dark here right now because it's about to storm. So I was trying to get some good light, but I don't know if it's working. Let me see. So yeah, got that for him. And again, I don't know if he's going to take a pacifier. Um, because like I've said, Sefton did not take a pacifier at all, but I'm hopeful this baby will. Um, so I got this cute little clip. And then also got this cute pacifier. Um, it's the pop and basically what it does is if the pacifier falls like on the floor, it closes up. So um yeah we'll see how that works although i still would wash my baby's pacifier if it falls on the floor even if it does do that um but it's cute and um it matches the little clip so we'll see i've just been really collecting pacifiers at this point um because like i said i don't even know if he'll take a pacifier but i've just been getting different ones to test out uh, with him. I've gotten several as gifts as well. So I'll probably bring a few different ones in his, um, you know, hospital bag and see which ones he likes. But so I got this one. And then the last thing I got was this pacifier case to store extra pacifiers in. Um, so yeah, if he does like them, then I'll just have a backup in this little case and keep it in the um, diaper bag for him. So yeah, nothing that I necessarily needed, but because I was in the store, I was just like, let me just grab something. And yeah, that's pretty much everything that I got from Bye Bye Baby. And um, we're gonna get ready here in a minute because Sefton 
has swim um, this afternoon. We're doing his makeup swim classes because he missed a couple days while we were um, on vacation. So today is one of his makeup days. So we're going to do that and probably run a few other errands. I need to find the baby like um, a little like laundry basket um, because I want him to have his own separate laundry basket um, from everyone else because I'll be washing all of his clothes separate. Uh, so I want to find him a cute little, you know, laundry basket for all of his clothes. I think that's it. So, oh, I also need to stop and grab something, some eye drops. Um, because when he goes after his swim, he always, his eyes are always like bloodshot red and goggles don't work. So I need to pick him up some eye drops um, before we go to swim so that he'll have that afterwards because um, his eyes tend to get a little bit irritated. And yeah, so. So we are here at the swim school. We're early and this just reminded me of why I don't like Saturday sessions because it's a lot of people here on Saturdays. I like to do his swim classes during the week in the morning. So yeah, that's, that's the downside to these makeup classes because you can only make up on Saturdays so so yeah we're gonna go ahead and get ready to head in aside and then we're gonna grab some lunch after and maybe go to home goods so that I can look and see if they have some laundry baskets for the baby but yeah I'll check back in um, once we're done with swim <laughs> All right, guys, we have made it back home. <sighs> it has been quite the day. But anyway, I didn't have any luck in home goods, surprisingly. Uh, I just knew I would be able to find something in there, but it was slow pickings. Um, again, today is Saturday and I got a late start. And I know with home goods, you have to get in there early. So, anyway, I did find one at Target. Um, and I got a few other things, but this is the one that I got. It's by the brand Pillowford and it is collapsed right now, but I'm going to open it so you guys can see how it looks open. All right. So here is how it looks fully open. Very cute. And it goes really well with the furniture and all the little accent things here. So this will just go on the side of the dresser with the like diaper pail. And it's pretty large. I mean, he's a baby, so his clothes are tiny. So I didn't want anything like, like large, um, but I did want something that just looked nice and so I got this one and I'll link the price I can't remember exactly how much it was but I think it was like $30 but I'll link it if you're interested I mean it doesn't have to be for a baby you can use it just you know as a regular laundry basket if you wanted to but I got that and then I just picked up a few other things so I am in the process of working on my hospital bag. Um, I know a few of you have asked me in the comments if I am going to do a what's in my hospital bag. Yes, I am. Uh, I'm getting things together right now uh, because I do not want to make the same mistake that I made the first time. 
I overpacked. I didn't use half the stuff that I brought. And so I am not doing that this time. I am only bringing the essentials and the things that I am going to need. So yeah, stay tuned for that. I'll be working on that in the next few weeks, but I am gonna do one. Um, I'm also gonna do the diaper bag as well. So it'll be a hospital and diaper bag situation video. Um, so I picked up another style of nursing bras. Um, I love the ones that I am currently using and I plan to use those as well. Um, but I do remember getting this style when I had my first child and I loved it because it doesn't have the snap. You just like pull it open. So these are great for nighttime, like feedings in the middle of the night when you don't feel like fussing with the little snap thing on the traditional nursing bras this one is just like a v and you literally just flop your boob out and you just put it back on so um i wish they had it in black but they didn't they just had it in this like cream color and this purple color which is fine because like i said it'll be mainly for night nursing situations but yeah i wanted to get a different style and I just got some more of my pro and prebiotic gummies because I am out um, and I've really been enjoying these during my pregnancy these have been great so wanted to get some more of these and then I just picked up a new thing of lotion I went in to get a new bottle of the Neutrogena Hydro Boost lotion that I have been using and I love, but they don't have it. Um, they haven't had it for a while, so I don't know if it's discontinued or what, but I saw this. It's the Vaseline Intensive Care Almond Smooth with almond oil, vitamin E, and Vaseline jelly. So I'm a sucker for new stuff <laughs> like most of us here. So I picked up a bottle of this and it is a pump. So um, that'll be nice. So I got that and then just picked up some eye drops for Sefton. I told you guys I needed to get him some eye drops. So I got him this Aloe eye drops and guess what? His eyes weren't bothering him today after swim. So yeah such is life but we have them now but anyway that is it for this vlog guys thank you all so much for coming along with me these past couple of days if you have any questions or comments just list them below don't forget to subscribe and i'll catch you on my next one bye